Illegal guns off the street and providing a safer place to live is the focus of a special town hall meeting tonight in Stockton. Our mission is to turn a would-be gun offender into a taxpayer or rehabilitated citizen. Right now, faith leaders are gathering at Quail Lakes Baptist Church to talk about the ways they can work together to hopefully find a solution to the ongoing problem. Let's find out more. CBS 13's Carlos Correa is live tonight in Stockton with one program community leaders say certainly can help out. Carlos? And good evening to you. Community members will be hearing about an innovative program called Gun Bail, which uses an app on your smartphone to help remove illegal guns from off the street. It's an idea business owner Trevor Brooks hopes to one day bring to cities around the country. A simple solution, he says, that would remove illegal guns off the street and reduce crime. We can remove the guns faster than they can be replenished on the street, but we can also help change the mindset of the individual who feels that he is lost. He or she is lost and they have no opportunity. Brooks is the CEO of Gun Bail, a program he hopes to roll out in 2018 in cities in Missouri, South Carolina, and California. Everyone eligible for our program can surrender an illegal gun anonymously through our app. They will be processed and released on non-financial bail release for surrendering that gun. And then they will be funneled into job training, job placement, mental health, or drug uh, treatment. Gun bail is just one of the many programs planned to be discussed at a special town hall meeting in Stockton, where the number of homicides for this year has already reached 46. We want to get out of the day. There's hope that there are solutions. There are a lot of good things that are happening uh, in the community already. But there are some more things that need to be done. Williams hopes the town hall meeting will be a starting point for residents and members of all congregations to come together and search for ways to reduce crime. What motivated me to do this, I just did a funeral a few weeks ago. Young man was shot to death. He was shot twice in the face. I'm tired of burying young people due to gun violence. So I'm just trying to find a way to help answer that problem. Now, the town hall meeting starts at 6.30 this evening. The public is invited to attend. Williams hopes to have even more town hall meetings down the road. Back to you. All right, Carlos, thanks.